excited? How many of us are excited to be alive today? Amen. We give God praise for another wonderful time in his presence. Another opportunity for us to be able to gather together to lift the name of our God high. But again, another opportunity for us to offer our praises to God. And we know that when praises go up, what comes down? Amen. So on behalf of Discovery Center and every child of God all over the world, I want to welcome you to Ignite 2.0. You don't sound excited. I want to welcome you to Ignite 2.0. Woo! Amen. How many of us were present for the first edition? How many of us was? How many of us? Okay, not a lot of us, but we had an awesome time in the presence of God. And, um, you know, we believe that every year is going to get better. Amen? So much more than what God did last year, we know that he's going to do this year. And the awesome thing is that we are all here to be partakers of this awesome thing that God wants to do. So without any further ado, I want to welcome Pastor Kola for our opening prayer. Let's put our hands together, please. We can do better than that if we are doing it for the almighty God. Let's give God praise. Let's bless his name. God bless you. Shall we rise up? Shall we rise up as we take the opening prayer? And I want us to just say thank you to the Lord for choosing today and for bringing it to pass. Just appreciate the Lord. Let him hear you talking to him. Just say thank you, God. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. For helping your church to pick today for Ignite 2.0 and the Lord bring it to pass. It's not happening in your absence. You are not in the grave today. You are not in the hospital. You are alive to see today. Daddy, we thank you. We thank you for Ignite 1.0. We thank you for 2.0 that, that is about to start now. We give you praise. We glorify your name. Thank you for what you did last year. Thank you for the testimony that still abounds to you today. We give you thanks. We allowed your name. Let's thank God for what God is about to do now. Lord, we thank you. Thank you. Thank you for what you are about to do. Thank you, thank you for the miracles that will take place here today. Thank you, oh God, for the testimony that we follow after today's event. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Let's pray that the glory of the Lord should fill this place. Lord, let your glory fill this place. As we start the program, oh God. Let the glory of God fill this place more than ever before. Lord Almighty, let your glory fill this place. Let your glory fill this place. Let your glory fill this place. Let's pray that God, let, oh God, different kind of testimony begin to take place. Almighty God, in your presence, <laughs> oh, many things happen. Let there be miracles here today. Let there be signs here today. Let there be wonders here today. Almighty God, let no problem that follow anyone here today, let it not go back with them. As we go into the realm of praise, into the realm of worship, Almighty God, do the unusual. Do the unthinkable. In the name of Jesus. Do the unusual. Do the unthinkable. Do the unusual. Do the unthinkable. In the name of Jesus. Let's pray for as many that are supposed to be here today. Let's pray. Father, remove every obstacle from their way. 
Lord, Almighty, as many that are supposed to be here today, Jehovah, bring them. Almighty God, bring them from the north, from the east, from the south, from the west. They will not miss their portion of blessing. In the name of Jesus, let's lift up all the ministers of God that God is going to use here today. Let's lift them up before the Lord, the Bekes, and the other invited, invited artists. Almighty God, Lord, let your power fill them to the prayer. Lord, use them like never before. Use them, oh God, even to their own amazement. In the name of Jesus, let signs and wonders follow the administration. Thank you, everlasting Father. We give you praise. We bless your holy name. Thank you, Jesus. We thank you. At the end of today's program, oh God, let's have cause to glorify your name. We worship you. We worship you. We hand over this meeting unto you, Holy Spirit. Take control. Take preeminence. Have your way. Do what you alone can do. At the end, oh God, let our coming be heavily rewarded. We give you all the glory. In Jesus' wonderful name, we are praying. Daddy, we hand over this meeting unto you. In the name of God the Father. In the name of God the Son. In the name of God the Holy Spirit. What you alone can do, do it in our midst. Lord, when, oh God, Paul and Silas, they pray, they sing, they sang, seriously. Lord, the chain was loose. The door, the prison door was open. Almighty God, you can repeat miracle. Today, repeat Paul and Silas' experience in the name of Jesus. Let every chain be loosed. Let every locked door open. And let your name be glorified. Thank you, Almighty God. In Jesus' wonderful name, we have prayed. Let the children of God say a thunderous amen. A powerful amen. Give a shout of hallelujah unto the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. My brothers and sisters, you are very welcome to this wonderful, special occasion. Today, we are launching a night 2.0. Today, we are launching Ignite 2.0. I need a bigger clap for that. I would like to invite um, everyone in the hall to please occupy the front seats. And while you're doing that, please come forward, come forward. And while you're doing that, you just greet each other. Say hello to your neighbor. Say welcome. Shake their hands. In the spirit of love, the Lord is with us tonight. We are highly pleased. We are highly favored. We have people from all over. People from Zimbabwe, cutting through Cameroon, Nigeria, present here today. And we have extended people watching and streamlining. So all over the world, they are witnessing this wonderful, spectacular event. With that in mind, I would like to welcome a special person in our midst today. She is a songwriter, a Jesus lover, a composer, a musician for the Lord. And whatever I say is not going to be enough compared to the sweet melodies she's going to be 
dishing out for us today. So without further ado, I would like to let her music speak more than my words can do. With that being said, I would like to welcome Carly Adams, please. You give a bigger hand of applause for Carly Adams. God bless you. Amen. Praise the Lord. Isn't God good? All the time, he's so good. Um, I'm going to sing you two songs, but you know, the most important person in this place is God. So we're just going to welcome, continue to welcome the Holy Spirit. Can we please rise as we worship God together and enter into his courts of praise, enter into his house with worship. Thank you, God. Spirit, you are welcome in this place. Take preeminence. You be seen, you be heard, you be felt. There's nothing worth more that could ever come close. Nothing can compare. You're our living hope. Your breath. Of the sweetest of love 
Yes, Lord. We want to be overwhelmed by you, Jesus, and overcome and overtaken by your presence, Jesus. You are the only one that matters. I don't know about you guys, but 2019 has been a little bit of a difficult year. And you know what? Sometimes you have to encourage yourself. And you know what? You have to speak to yourself daily and say, you know what, soul? It is well. It is well. So I don't know where you are right now. But can you tell your soul, it is well. Right now. It is well. It is well. Amen.
as long as you keep your eyes fixed on the author and the finisher of your faith, as long as you keep your eyes fixed on Jesus, it is well with you. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Thank you so very much, Mr. Kali Adams. That was amazing. Quite a number of us are still seated at the back. So if we don't mind, please, can we please move forward? Please. Come in front, please. <laughs> Come collect your blessings. See, the front seats have a lot of blessings. It gets diluted when it goes back. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Amen. Sometimes I thank you again, Mr. Kali Adams. Sometimes I wonder why I can't sound like her, you know. There's this, um, do you, I don't know. Mm. <laughs> it just doesn't, I don't know. I don't know if it's the Africanness in me or it's, it just uh, doesn't work. Mm, 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 mm. Dummy, you, dummy, dummy. Let me tell can you. Can I try it again? No, no, true, no. True, mm, true, mm, true, mm, mm. true. Maybe See, you give me the key. You need to first sign up for the voice Jehovah. Wait. That is me, what happens when you sign up for the voice Jehovah. Did, did, you are a child of God. You can't give up on people. No, Calm I'm down. not. I'm give sending me, you to the right path. Sign up. Wait. It's open. You don't even know what. Just, can you give me that song again? Two. <laughs> you're getting there, you're getting there. One more time. I'm trying, Abby. Yeah, yeah. Through it all. Through it all. Uh -huh. Through it. <coughs> Let's give her a round true, of applause, please. Through it all. Uh -huh. <laughs> See? <laughs> Thank you, Kylie Adams. I'll try next time. Not today, anyway. <laughs> anyway. Moving on, we would like to welcome a wonderful minister of God to lead us into the presence of God with worship and with songs. So let's put our hands together as we welcome Minister Yinka Adesonya. Let's put our hands together, please. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I'm not sure about minister, but just Yinka is fine. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. If you're happy to be in the presence of the Lord, give the Lord a big shout. And please rise up on your feet as we go into God's presence this evening. Hallelujah. You know that song, sing with me. Let's go. You are Alpha and Omega. We worship you, our Lord. You are worthy to be praised. We give you
Jesus. Oh, Jesus, your name is powerful. <laughs> oh, Jesus, your name is wonderful. <laughs> oh, this song is as simple as that. Let's go together. Let's go. Oh, Jesus. Hey, oh, Jesus. Your name, your name is power. It is a strong tower. Oh, Jesus. Your name, your name, your name is powerful. Oh, Jesus. I would like 
like to say thank you, Jesus.
Jehovah. One more time. Jehovah. Jehovah, that is the name that I rely on when I'm in chains. Jehovah, that name breaks up the walls of shame. Jehovah. already so I'm guessing we can share the grace and go home now eh no not yet no we need more we need more of that no? blessing okay okay no shaking we, we need just more warming blessing. up eh <laughs> we're just warming up okay all right we're going to hear a bit of the word of God now and for that we'd like to invite Bro Femi Olajide for the Bible reading and announcement thank you Praise the Lord. Praise the living Jesus. If you're a living soul, can you praise the Lord the way it's meant to be done? Praise the Lord. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. We welcome you again to today's of praise night. It's the second one, as you will know. Some people were here last year, and this is another one. We'll talk more about that later. But now, we'll go into the Bible reading. And the only Bible reading for this uh, evening service and time to praise God is taken from the book of Psalm, Psalm 100, and we'll read five verses there. It's just about five verses, so we'll read everything. I said, Make a joyful shout to the Lord, all ye lands. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before his presence with singing. Know that the Lord he is good. It is he who has made us and not we ourselves. We are his people and the sheep of his pasture. Enter into his gate with thanksgiving and into his courts with praise. Be thankful to him and bless his name. Verse 5. For the Lord is good. His mercy is everlasting and his truth endures to all generations. And I pray that his truth and faithfulness will be endured in our lives in the name of Jesus. Amen. Now quickly, we would like to go through our announcement. That is, this is special for RCCG Discovery Center, Auckland, New Zealand. Where destinies are discovered and champions are raised. So... You can follow me as I go through our announcement. Every Sunday, we meet at AUT University campus. And normally, we use WG126 at AUC, uh, AUT University, the city campus. Please, tomorrow, we are inviting you to join us. We will start by 10 a.m. with Sunday school. And after that, we go into praise and worship by 10.30. And around 12, we finish the service. And it, all, it has always been amazing every Sunday in our midst. And we want you to join us tomorrow to have a taste of what it is to be in Discovery Center. And also, every last Friday of the month is our program called PWC. And what do we mean by PWC? Praise, worship, and communion. I am not saying this so that you will come, but I want you to come this Friday, 25th, because since we started, it has always been testimony galore. Every month, there's always a winner. And I'm expecting who's going to be the winner for last month, because this Friday, the testimony will come. And I want you to join us to listen to the testimony yourself. So 
this Friday by 7.30 p.m., we'll be gathered together at WG126 AUT City Campus for our PWC program. And on Sunday, the first Sunday is usually our gratitude Sunday. The second Sunday, we have a growth service. And on the third Sunday, we have a career service. And the last Sunday of the month is our relationship Sunday. We welcome you to join us in any of these uh, services at DWG126. Even as we are believing that very soon we will have our own property. If you believe with me, can you shout hallelujah? Amen. And also, right now, we are in the program Ignite 2.0. Last year, we did the, it was 1.0. And I can see some faces that were there last year as well, and they are here. And you can say of a truth that this is bigger than the last year, the one we did last year. And it's going to be an annual program. Next year, I know, it's going to be bigger than this by the special grace of God. I want to thank our invited guests. They are all here. Thank you for being here, and we appreciate you. And I think uh, our evangelism as well, we want to encourage you. It's something that we must do as Christians. And as we do this, God will help us in Jesus' name. And if there are other announcements, before we finish the service, we will be made known by the MC or the pastor. Thank you, and God bless. Uh, thank you very much, uh, Brother Femi. Uh, thank you, thank you, Brother Femi, for that, uh, for that uh, wonderful presentation and announcement. I know Brother Femi said uh, he's not inviting everybody to come tomorrow, but I am saying something else. Come tomorrow. Everybody come tomorrow. You are all invited. You are highly welcome to Discovery Center, where destinies are discovered. Actually, that was where ZZ for Africa was discovered. So if you want to discover yourself, come to Discover, Discovery Center. Um, we are very happy for we have a special guest in our midst today. All the other guests that have come through have been special. But then we could not leave this evening without giving a chance for the AAMA Gospel New Act New Zealand 2016 winner in the house. We would like you to all put your hands together as we welcome. Oh, okay. You see, um, certain uh, situations would actually permit us to put a hold on that. We wouldn't want to just serve you up with the best gospel news land you act 2016 just yet. We would we'll just keep the, the best for the last while we call on Minister Eric who's come all the way from Sydney, Australia. He's present in the house. We would like him to come bless us with what the Lord has for us today. Hello, Discovery Center. I'll make a joyful noise unto the Lord. Are you excited to be here tonight? Talk back to me. Are you excited to be here tonight? Amen. Now, some of you are not smiling. <laughs> Amen. You say I'm back again. Yes, I was here 101. I'm here 102. And we'll be here 101 time. Amen. Now, turn to the person next to you and just smile to them. Just smile. Smile to them. Smile. Don't, don't, don't say anything to them, but just smile to them. Now, uh, amen. It is a joyful thing to be in the house of the Lord. Do you believe that? Amen. For the next 15 minutes, I believe that God wants to do something great. And even to the end of the program, as many that has come here with one or two burdens in your heart, God is not a man that should lie, neither the son of man that should repent. So I'd like you to please kindly stand up on your feet, um, please, uh, as we engage in worship. Lift up your two hands to heaven and just...
talk to the Lord. Prashiti lele de uska balalahandus. Zada dada ba shati lele de uska dada balabaladas. Lika to shati lele de uska dada balabaha. Lika dada dada ba sandi lele de us. Come on, let it out of you. It's not about me tonight. It's about Jesus. La city did it with Shapala Brahan, the Redabaski did this. Zabala did it this, Karadabala Bahan did it this, Shatarabas Ali Kadada Shatarababa. Come on, release yourself tonight. Release yourself. Release yourself for the glory. Release yourself. Masata Palabra, the Redabas Sati did it with Kiri with Saba. Sati did this. Come on, come on. You are wiser than the wisest. You are greater than the greatest. You are beautiful than the most beautiful. I bow to you. Oh, you're a in the sick room. You're a lawyer in the courtroom. You are the builder of every home. I bow to you. For you are wiser than the wisest. You are greater than the greatest. You are beautiful than the most beautiful. I bow to you. Oh, you're a doctor in the sick room. You're a lawyer. Oh, everything to me, Jesus. There is no one compared to you. I bow 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 to you. There is no one compared to you. I bow to you. There is no one compared to you. I bow to you. I bow to you. I bow to you, oh, I bow to you, there is no one compared to you, I bow to you, oh, there is no one compared to you. I bow to you. Lift up your hands. You are wiser than the wisest. You are greater than the greatest. You are beautiful, so beautiful. I bow to you. You are a lawyer, so great you are. There is no one compared to you. I bow to you. You are the God that gave let and also make a life. You are my glory. And the lifter off of my head, oh, God of fire, 
You are the God of thunder. Come and do what only you can do. Mighty man of war, Lion of Judah, we bow down and worship you. Yahweh, Yahweh, come and do what only you can do. Lift up your hands and just give Lord the glory. Come on, open your mouth and just worship him. Hey, hey, hey. You are the glory that lifts my head, Jesus. There is no one like you, Jesus. You reign from generation to generation. Nobody like you. We love you, Jesus. We give you glory. Come and do what only you. Come on, join me and sing. Mighty man of war. Mighty man. Raise your voice and sing to him. Hey, Lion of Judah. We bow down. We bow and worship you, Yahweh, Yahweh, yes, Jesus, come and do what only you, mighty man of war, man of war. Lion of Judah, we bow down, we bow down and worship you, Yahweh, Yahweh, oh yes Lord, Yahweh, come and do what only you. Oh, 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 victory belongs to Jesus. Victory belongs to Him. Oh, 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 victory belongs to Jesus. Victory belongs to him. Oh, 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 victory belongs to Jesus. Victory belongs to him. Come on, sing with me. Oh, raise your voice and sing. Oh, victory belongs to Jesus. Victory belongs to Him. Come on, sing, say. Oh, 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 oh victory belongs. Victory belongs. To him. The Bible says that in the year that King Uzziah died, Isaiah saw the glory of God. I hear in my spirit that God is lighting up every dark places. As many that has been here tonight, it's not an event as usual. 
This is an experience, an encounter with the Holy Spirit. But you need to engage. Like worship is proactive. When praises goes up, it's blessings come down. So I want to urge every one of you, I don't have much time, I believe I have five minutes or seven minutes left. I don't come here to entertain because it is never unto us, O God. In Psalm 115, never unto us, but unto the name of the Lord. We give all the glory. So I want you to lift up your hands in this room. The Holy Spirit is pushing me in a different direction tonight. I was going through a stage in my life, and usually God gives me song through some really mess situations that comes around. And I really want to bless God for that. So I was going through this stage in my life where it's as if nothing was working out for me. prayed. I don't know how many of you have prayed and you fasted, but it looks like nothing is working for you. Or it might just be maybe me. There's no problem. So it's going through this season of my life and to see if the old world was going to end. But I went to church and I began to hear a melody in my spirit and God began to speak to me. Then I heard a song which goes, is that you plant my feet? Upon the rock to stand, you ordered my steps in the way that I should go. When the enemy start, they've crushed me down and down. Jesus said, No, I will never let you go. Sing it again. You plant my feet up on the rock to stay. You ordered my steps in a way that I should go. Oh, when the enemy start, they've crushed me down and down. Jesus said, no, I will never let you go. And so I hear this. For the things you've done for me, oh God, I just want to say thank you. So can we sing that song to the Lord just for the things, say for the things you've done for me, oh God, I just want to say thank you, Lord. Sing it for the things, for the things you've done for me, oh God. I just want to say thank you, Lord. Lift up your hands to heaven. Lift it, lift it higher. Mm, I just want to say thank you. Sing it for the things, for the you've done for me, oh God. I just want to say thank you. Come on, talk to the Lord. As I'm running up my worship, talk to him. Okay, raise your voice and sing the song to the Lord. For the things, for the things done for me. Hey, hey, hey. Thank you, Lord. Sing 
for the things, things you've done for me, oh God. I just want to say thank you. Let's sing it one more time for the things, for the things you've done for me. I Jesus, you love me too much, oh, too much, oh. Lift up your hands. Hey, hey, hey. Jesus, you love me too much, oh. Your love is kind. Your love is patient. Sing it to the Lord. You feel my heart. With so much peace and joy, you're amazing, Father. You're amazing. You make my life feel brand new. Hey, you're amazing. You make my life feel brand new. Jesus, you love me too much. Oh. Too much oh, excess love. Oh. Raise your voice. Sing, say, Jesus, you love me too much, oh. Too much, oh, excess love, oh. Thank you for loving me too much, oh. Unconditionally. Thank you for loving me, for loving me, for loving me. Thank you so much for loving me the way I am, oh God. If it had not been for you, where would I be today? You brought me up from the miry clay and set me on the rock to stand. I love you, Jesus. You are everything to me. So I bow to you. I bow to you. I bow to you, oh, I bow to you. There is no one compared to you. I bow to you. There is no one compared to you. Bow to you. Let me hands together for Jesus. Thank you, Minister Eric. Thank you for that uh, uplifting and inspiring message. You know, sometimes 
we are in a haste for God's blessing. Sometimes we rush things and we want God to bless us immediately. Sometimes when we go through hardship, we forget to know it's usually God's way of telling us to be patient. Hardship is just God's disguise for patience. For he has many good things in store, waiting for the right moment. That was very uplifting from uh, Minister Eric. That was very touching. And I can say vehemently that I feel the presence of God in this house. Through each and every minister, through each and every man of God who has come, who has been on this stage, be it up here or down there, to give us God's message, to bring us together, to make us to always be happy in the presence of the Lord. To give our hearts out to God, to praise Him, to glorify His name, to confirm and to affirm and to reaffirm His presence in our life, His position as our God, our one and only, the Alpha, the Omega, the beginning and the end, the God who is and who will always be our Redeemer. So in this same spirit, and without further delay, I would like us all to welcome Amara Duru on stage. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I apologize for coming late <laughs> to my sister, especially Sister Misola. Um, there are things at times that we can actually control, don't have control over. So I don't mean to disrespect you. This is not my style. Usually I come early. So I just want to say hello to everybody here today. And you guys are looking beautiful as usual. <laughs> Thank you, Bro Eric, for those beautiful melodies. I have two songs for you this evening. The first one said, Mercy said no. And the second one said, The day he wore my crown. You see how it goes? <laughs> May you be blessed in Jesus' name. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was just a child when I felt the Savior leading. I was drawn to what I could not understand. For the cost of Christ, I've spent my days believing. For what he had me be is who I am. As I've come to see the weak inside of me, I realize his grace is what I need. I sin the mind then justice for my soul. Mercy said no. you go I'm not gonna let you sleep away you don't have to be afraid mercy said no sin will never take control life and death stood face to face darkness trying to steal my heart away thank you Jesus Mercy said no 
Oh yeah For God so loved the world That he sent his son to save us From the cross he built A bridge to set us free But deep within our hearts That is still a world of rages Make a sacrifice so hard to see as me not fell on crucifixion day the light of hope seemed up so far away as if we try to stop redemption's flow mercy said no you go I'm not gonna let you sleep away you don't have to be afraid mercy said no sin will never take control life and death stood face to face darkness tried to steal my heart away thank you Jesus Reminded me of one day longer ago. Long ago. No, she said no. I'm never let you go. Hallelujah. <laughs> Are we good at back there? The city was Jerusalem. The time was a long ago. The people called him Jesus. His crime was the love he showed. And I'm the one to blame. I caused all his pain. Yeah, I said the day he wore my crown. He brought me love that only he 
give. I brought him cause to cry. But he taught me how to leave. I taught him how. And I'm the one to blame. I caused all his pain. He gave himself the day he wore my crown. He could have fought. me away please take me away he would have said I'm not guilty I'm not gonna stay I'm not gonna pay But he walked right through the gate and then up on the hills. As he fell beneath the weight, he cried, he cried, Father, it's not my will. Amen. I'm sure we can do better than that for Jesus. Amen. Thank you so much, Amara. God bless you. Amen. We are just getting started. Tell your neighbor we are just getting started. Say it like you mean it. We are just getting started. <laughs> so moving on, I'd like to invite a wonderful minister of God, a singer, a songwriter, a woman of God, highly anointed, someone who God has used to answer long-standing prayers of a lot of us the co-host of Ignite, and most importantly, she's my pastor. So with Jesus' joy, with excitement in our hearts, let's put our hands together for Pastor Busola Martins. You, can't. If you are clapping for Jesus, make it bigger and bigger and bigger. If you are clapping for the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, the one that gave you breath 
in your nostrils, the one that borrowed you the air that you breathe every time. Make it big and shout hallelujah. Jesus is the host of tonight. He's your host and my host, our host. Lift your hands. Awesome God. We bless you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Lift up your hands and worship. Father, we worship. Jesus, we give you praise. Mighty man of war. Oh God, we adore you. Lift up those hands. Come and worship him. You are the awesome God. You are the first and last. My beginning, you are. You are my very end. Your name is holy. Your name is Lion of Judah. Mighty man of war. You never lost a battle. Holy, holy, holy Lord God Almighty. That's what the angels have been saying. That's what they're saying right now. That's what they'll keep saying. And I want to invite you so that we sing and speak the same language with all of heaven. Just sing, Holy are you, Lord. All creation, including me.
solution provider, I worship you. I worship you. I worship you. My solution provider, I worship you. Lift your hands, say, I worship you.
questions in the corners of your mind and traces of discouragement peace you cannot find in case you do not know that the word of God is true and everything is promised Thank you. 
whatever situation is, but they're going to turn for your good. In the name of Jesus, we say, we say,
You're a good, good father. It's who you are. It's who you are. It's who you are. And I'm loved by you. It's who I am. It's who I am. Thank you, Jesus. It's who I am. We're all searching for answers far and wide, but I know we're all searching for answers only you provide, cause you know just what we need before we say a word. You're a good, good father to you. loved by you who I am who I am who I am, who I am. you are perfect in all Even in the midst of the tears. Even in the midst of the tears, he's walking you through a process. I see tears, tears, pain, tears, pain. He's perfect in all his ways, regardless of what you're going through. Thank you, Jesus. He hasn't made a mistake with you, he's just walking you through the process. You are perfect in all of your ways. You are perfect in all of your ways. You are perfect in all of your ways. To us. Good, good Father. To you are. To you are. To you are. Merciful Father. your hands and receive his mercy this minute. We receive your mercy. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, good, good Father. Thank you for making us in your image. Thank you for being our God. Thank you for this life. Thank you for all the tribulations we face. Because in tribulations, you give us strength. You remind us we are only human. And we can do nothing without you. Thank you for your presence in our life. Thank you for this big congregation. Thank you for everyone gathered here today. Thanking us 
Thank you for giving us the time to come and share in your presence. For you said in your holy word, where two or three are gathered, you are always in our midst. We pray you remain in our midst today and for the rest of our lives. We pray you always be with us. Guide and protect us. Show us the way, for you are the truth, the way, and the light. Shine brightly and everlastingly in our lives. Let your light shine through us so that the world might see your glory, so that the world might revere in your name. We thank you, Father. We thank you for everything you've done for us. For the good jobs, the not so good jobs, the smiles, the happiness, the pains, the tears. We thank you for everything. You are our provider. You've given us the chance to provide for others, for our families, for our friends. And sometimes we even forget ourselves in the process. But you stay true to it. You stay true to us. You still continue to give us strength. Even when we are down, even when we have accidents, you pull us back up. You bless us and you give us the courage to move ahead. We thank you for hope. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Father, thank you, Jesus. Now we'll move to the next phase of our program, which will be all about fundraising. And for this, I would like to invite Reverend Brian to give us more details about this. Put your hands together for Reverend Brown, please. I would like to put your hands together. A bigger clap for Reverend Brown, for he has been special. He's been always present. Every time he comes to join this little family, and just the little peop the little presents and the little uh, people that gather together, it makes the family bigger, bigger in the eyes of the Lord. And we want to thank him too for all he has been doing for his messages. So we call on him again to grace our presence with one of such messages. Let the church say amen. I said, let the church say amen again. I thought we came out to praise the Lord tonight. Let the church say amen. amen. What a mighty, mighty, mighty God we serve. Who's having a wonderful time this evening? Just one or two. Who's having a wonderful time in the house of God tonight? What a blessing it is to be here at Ignite 2.0. Certainly to Pastor Ayo and Bustola Martins, I greet you in the name of Jesus. Why don't you just give the pastors of this house a mighty hand of praise? I wasn't prepared to say anything tonight, but the word says be prepared in season and out of season. And so the task I have ahead is titled as fundraising. Now, we know that God owns everything, right? We know that even the very breath that we breathe comes from Him. We know the fact that the reason why we're here is because He woke us up and He brought us into this place so we could worship Him. But in order to do something like this tonight, I don't believe that 
this, the owners of this building allowed us to come here without giving them something financially to sit in these seats. Would that be correct? I also know there's many that have come from offshore to minister to us tonight with the gifts that God has graciously bestowed upon them. I thank you, my brother, I believe from Sydney, and I believe there's others from the Pacific Rim and maybe even outside of the Rim that not thought it robbery, but willing to come and pour into us the gifts that God has graciously poured into them so that his name could be lifted up high. And so I ask and I plead with you if you would just open up your wallets, open up your handbag, and just think the fact that the homes that you live in, the cars that you drive, the clothes that you wear, God graciously gives you the monies to do that. So just think for a moment the sacrifice that these ministers have given to be with us tonight. What it's taken to put on an event like this, the building and everything else. And just take a portion of your income that God has given to you and just pour it into this house, into this ministry. Because God is doing something mightily through RCCG DC. You know, I first came to the ministry, I think it was their second or third week of service, and I said to Pastor Ayo and Pastor Martins, I said, Pastor Martins, I said, what we see here is only maybe a few in number, but what I see ahead are the multitudes. I, I see stadiums, I see other churches being birthed out of this ministry I see multitudes of souls being plucked out of hell and added to the Lamb's book of life. Because these two people have stepped out in faith and said, I'm prepared to open up my mouth and preach the gospel. I'm prepared to actually minister and give of my life to those that are not yet in a right relationship with him. So I plead with you tonight. Is there going to be an offering basket or anything going around or anything? I don't know but it's coming around, just give into this house. Because it's not about us, it's all about him. It's all about precious souls being added to the Lamb's book of life. You know, when I think that once I was on the way to hell, but his grace and his mercy picked me up and turn me around. And there isn't any amount of monies that I would not give to see a soul added to the Lamb's book of life. So can I just pray for the offering and pray for those that are willing to give tonight. Almighty and everlasting God, I say thank you. I thank you, Lord, for your grace and your mercy. I thank you, Lord, for I know that the very breath that we breathe comes from you. And for life upon this earth, I say thank you. I thank you, Lord, that you've allowed for this event, Ignite 2.0, to occur tonight. A place where we can come together as a representation of your church and worship so now, Lord, I ask that you'll just touch the hearts and the minds of all that are gathered. Lord, whatever it is that your people are able to give, or maybe there are some that aren't able to give, but use what is given for the continued upbuilding of your kingdom so that your name will be magnified, your name will be glorified, souls will be saved. Hell will be depleted. Heaven will rejoice. For your word says, there is joy in heaven over even one repenting sinner. Continue to minister to us tonight. Touch the voices of those who will open up their mouth and sing songs of praise. 
Use these monies, Lord. Allow us to be stewards of what you've given to us. To be used to fulfill your purpose and your glory. And all those in agreement said, Amen. Why don't you just give God a mighty, mighty hand of praise. I believe you can do a bit better than that. Give God a mighty hand of praise. Because I don't believe that heaven's going to be quiet. I believe we're just warming up. Somebody give God a mighty, mighty hand of praise. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I believe. Okay. I believe I'm supposed to give these to anybody that wants to. Is that right? To put anything in the offering for um, this evening, tonight. All right? And without further ado, I believe Okay, great. So there are some envelopes coming around. Certainly feel free to put those in the baskets. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, Reverend. Put your hands together for Jesus. Hallelujah. Make it bigger. Make it bigger. Make it even bigger. And give the Lord a shout. So we've got some wonderful guests in the house tonight. All the way from Lagos, Nigeria, West Africa. Some of us have been following for a long, long time. If you've been following like a long, for a long, long time like me, can I see your hands? And there's something that happens when they hit the atmosphere with praise and worship. I remember in Sydney just a couple of weeks back during the intense praise. I'm not going to share what I caught, but I caught something different. And I'm not going to share that testimony until it happens. So don't take it for granted. Somebody said, don't take it for granted. Don't take it for granted. Look at your neighbor say, don't take it for granted. Don't, don't take it for granted. Be serious about it. So with Jesus' joy, we want to invite. I don't know how to describe them. They are lead composers, worshipers, musicians. In the RCCG church, not only in RCCG, in different churches all over the world. Um, not to praise men, but they have been all over the world. And when I say all over the world, I mean all over the world. And God moves. So let's rise on our feet with a big ovation for Jesus, for the work he's doing through them. Hallelujah. For Hallelujah. Daddy and Mommy. Tammy Lola and Bukola Bekis. Make it bigger, even bigger. Hallelujah. I want you to give it to Jesus. 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 Can you join you with a shout? Can you join you with a shout? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Our God is good. Time. Please be seated for a few minutes. Hallelujah. Amen. We want to say thank you to Pastor Ohio and Pastor Busola Martins and to Discovery Center Parish and everyone here tonight. We want to say thank you for bringing us and uh, we will come again and again and again and again. Yeah. And again. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Before we dance, I want to do a song with my husband. Don't worry, stay there. And it's titled... I am who I am today by the grace of God. The Bible says we are saved by grace. That no man should boast. It's not by power. It's not by mind. But by my spirit, says the Lord. He brought me out from the merry clay. And set my feet on the solid rock to stay. So whatever you see today about Bukola Bekis and Dabilola Bekis, it is all to the glory of God. 
I want you to wink to your neighbor and say, I am saved by grace. Hallelujah. testimony with your hands to him. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. I am who I am today by your grace. Hallelujah. I am who I am today by your of us that you daily Lord sit with your benefit for benefit of life benefit of good health so we have come to say thank you anybody grateful here tonight Amen. be deliberate be deliberate don't let anybody lead you lead yourself to the presence of the Lord 
deliberate tonight. Be deliberate. I worship you for who you are, Lord. God is good, God is kind, He is wonderful, He is beautiful, He is glorious, He is powerful, He is excellent. God is wonderful, there is none like Him. He mounts on invincible, the only wise God. Everlasting Father. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Many a times we come to the presence of the Lord. We are determined to praise. But by the time we come, we are weighed down by one thing or the other. But what I want you to do tonight is to command your spirit and your soul to praise God. Amen. Whatever Lord you have come here with, put it aside laid aside and say my spirit, my body, my soul, jump, shout wave, dance unto the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise my soul. The King join us. We can invite the angels to join us. So we say angels help us to
Sing it. There's no place for argument. You are God all by yourself. Everybody lift your voice. You are God. You are God.
yourself before him who is seated upon the throne as you join the 24 elders to sing the heavenly song the only song they sing in heaven is hallelujah to sing hallelujah Release yourself, release yourself, release yourself in this room, release yourself. Let it flow, let it flow. Oh no, 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 my Yatosha. Hallelujah. 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 Everybody release, release, just sing hallelujah. Sing it, Harry. You want to sing it? Hallelujah! 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 
Stand up in silence. This is the hour for the Father seeketh such to worship him in spirit and in truth. Solemnly let it flow from within. David said, I will not give unto my father what will not cost me something. Let the worship flow from within. Hallelujah. 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 Peace like a river is flowing in the room right now. Mahatujati handoza. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. Hey, hallelujah. See yourself in your bedroom just worshiping him. Hallelujah. 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 Church sing. Hallelujah. 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 All about this place, everybody lift to the sing. Hallelujah, 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 Invincible, the only wise God, the Almighty, the All Knowing, the Almighty, the Unchangeable, the Immovable, the Lion and the Lamb, the Glory and the Lifter of our heads. He that was and is and is to come, glorious in holiness. Fearful and praises, always doing wonder. Our rock, our strength, our defense, the pillar that holds her life, the unchangeable changer, the unshakable shaker, the immovable mover, the all God, the Almighty. Who we not bow before you? Who we not honor you? You are seated in heaven and you make the heart your first. How great thou art, how wonderful you are, how mighty you are, how glorious you are, how powerful you are. Heaven and earth adore you, and 
just bow before you. The 24 elders cry, Holy, 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 Lord God Almighty, who was and is and is to come. The great I am that I am, the banner, the pillar, the rock, and the shower, our God, our King, the glory and the lifter of our head. Who is this King of glory? The Lord, strong and mighty, the Lord, mighty in battle. Lift up your head, O oh ye gates, and be ye lifted up, ye everlasting doors. Let the King of glory come in. Let the King of glory come in. Let the King of glory come in. Who is this King of glory? The I am that is I am. Who is this King of glory? My Father, the controller of heaven and heart. Who is this King of glory? Or Lord Bogbara himself. Who is this King of glory? bless you Lord for you are good and your mercies endure from everlasting to everlasting we bless you Lord Jesus we worship you Lord Jesus if you can wave your hands wave your hands to him wave your hands to him wave your hands to him wave it wave it you can do better wave your hands to him in humble adoration we wave our hands to you, O oh God. We say you are glorious. If you can clap, clap your hands. Clap your hands, O oh ye people. Clap your hands, O oh ye people. Clap your hands, O oh ye people. If you can shout, shout. Hallelujah. I don't know about you, but the presence of the Lord is so sweet. The presence of the Lord refresh you. You come out and they see you and look at you as a new person. Hallelujah. Go to 10 people, give them high five and say, God is good. No, that's not how you would do it. Wait, 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 wait. Wait. If that's your neighbor is not smiling, like Pastor Ayo. If that's your neighbor cannot dance like Pastor Ayo. Hey. That's why you can dance. Hey, hi. <laughs> Give your neighbor a high five and say, God is good. God is good. God is good. God is good. My God. My God is good. Hallelujah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Leave your space. Leave your place. Go to another set of people. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Some people that have been sitting. Uh -huh. I see them going around. Yes. Hallelujah. Okay, we're doing a song right now that says, You are good, Jesus. Every day, every hour, you are good, Jesus. He says, You turn my mourning into dancing, you turn my sorrow into joy. He says, You are my keeper, my sustainer. You are good. Are you ready? You are good. You are good. You are good, Jesus. Every day, every hour, you are good, Jesus. You know what? You turn my money. Turn my sorrow into joy. He says, You are my keeper, my sustainer. You are good, Jesus. Verse 2 says, You supply. Seems 
to be no way. You are wonderful, counselor, mighty God. You are good, Jesus. Hallelujah. Yes, sir. Bring them, 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 bring them
Wait, 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 wait. Where are the Igbo people? See them, oh, see one Igbo man. See him going. Hey! Come, don't go yet now. Igbo people, come. Igbo Kwano. Igbo Kwano. See the Jesus. See Hallelujah, Moa, Dupe, and you know. 
Isaiah says, arise and shine, for your light has come, and the glory of the Lord is risen over you. So we say, amen, 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 amen. So every request.
word of the Lord says, Behold, I will do a new thing. He says, Now it shall spring forth. He says, Shall you not see it or know it? I will bring water from the desert. <laughs> He's saying, I'm doing a new thing in your life. He's taking you to a new land, a new face, a new grace has been released upon you tonight. New things, new things. Everybody say. children in this place tonight that they will have the mind of God which means that they will serve the Lord which means that the glory of the Lord will rest upon them and the Lord will mark them with the marks of life that no weapon that is formed or fashioned against them shall stand and I decree you for anyone here that is looking unto God for the fruit of the womb. Because you have come here to praise and bless the name of the Lord. The children like Samuel, like David, like Esther, that found favor with God. Children like our Lord Jesus Christ will find favor with men and with everyone. And I decree over everyone here today because you have sweated in the presence of the Lord. You have danced recklessly. The blessings of the Lord that make it rich and had no sorrow, it will be your portion in the name of Jesus. Those who seek the Lord will not seek him in vain. As you have come here tonight, those who have left, you will not seek God in vain. I pray that peace like a river will rest upon everyone in the name of Jesus. If you are troubled in any way, or there is anything called sickness, or there is anything called doctor's report, because you have come here tonight. The Almighty, the great healer himself will visit you tonight. And by the time we come next year for Ignite 3.0, you will come rushing and say, I have a testimony. So shall it be for you. In Jesus' name we pray. Hallelujah. Please, let's go. I just want all of us to kindly close our eyes, please. Um, within your heart, your heart is what communicates with you most. Nobody knows your heart, only God Almighty. Brethren, you know, it's going to be a waste of time, a waste of resources, and a waste of energy, a waste of time and, and, and flying times. For us to be here tonight and some of us will go back the same way we came. And what can make that happen is the fact that if you don't have any relationship with Jesus Christ, our Savior, I beg you in the name of Jesus, tonight, don't miss it. God has already poured blessings, breakthroughs, everything is with us. So that as we step outside there, we will not lose it. Because the enemy is always raging. The Bible says we fight, we, we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principality and powers. So there are powers, there are principalities all over. I beg you in the name of Jesus, you are here tonight. You have never surrendered your life to Jesus. 
or perhaps you have surrendered your life to Jesus, but somehow you, you, you know you, you disobey God some, one way or the other. I want everybody, eyes be closed, please. I want you to kindly raise up your hands. Can you imagine us flying all the way from Lagos, Nigeria, 20 something hours to get here? And today, and we now we come here and we minister unto God and minister unto men, and someone, someone will be here and will not give his or her life to Jesus. Ah, I don't want this day to stand against anybody. Please, you are there, you know you need to rededicate your life to Jesus. Please raise your hands. Or you need to surrender your life to you. Don't be ashamed. I'm telling you, I have done it before. Many people have done it before. You are here. You have never known Jesus. Or you have you need to rededicate your thank you, my sister. Thank you, my sister. I can see your hand. Please raise it up. Let God see your hand. Thank you, my sister. Thank you. Thank you. Raise it up. Please, all eyes closed. All eyes, please be closed. If you have raised your hand, please come and meet me on the altar here. You are going to receive double blessing tonight. What you did not bargain for, you will receive. Please come out. Come to the altar of the Almighty God. And let God know that you have declared for him today. And I bet you, it, your life will never remain. This. All eyes closed, please. You are here. You need to rededicate your life to Jesus. Please come, 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 come. God is calling you. Jesus is calling you. Please come, 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 come. You are still there. The spirit is telling you that, oh, my, you need to come out. But one enemy is saying, don't mind them. Don't bother. Don't do anything. Please, don't listen to that foul voice. Don't listen to that evil voice. Don't listen to that liar. The devil is a liar. And the father of it all. Please come. Come, come, my brothers and sisters. Please come, 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 come. Still waiting. I will count up to five. After that, after that, we pray. We pray. And we'll be off the stage. I will count one. You know you are there. God is telling you. Holy Spirit is talking to you. That you need to come and rededicate your life. Please come out. Number two. Holy Spirit is still nudging you. Appealing to you. That don't miss today. This is not the kind of day you see every time. Please come on. Number three. If the Lord is speaking to you, please come out. Don't, don't resist that voice. God doesn't struggle. Holy Spirit doesn't struggle with anybody. He will call you. He will speak to you. He will adjure you. He will talk to you. That you need to come out. But the enemy will say, no, don't bother. Don't, no, that's the voice of the devil. Please come out. Number four. All eyes remain closed, please. Number four. And the last number. Number five. All eyes remain closed still. My brothers, please come, come here, come here. Please come here. Just repeat after me. Say, look, I come back to you. I come back to you. I come back to you. And the time for me because of that voice of the devil, I pray you will not suffer from that voice of the devil. And you accept the Lord. surround them 24 7 in jesus name and you will never go back to the world again in the name of jesus i cover you in the blood of jesus and i say you will excel in the name of jesus you will excel in the name of jesus you will excel in the name of jesus and on the last day you will not miss heaven in the name of jesus so shall it be in the name of 
Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Please go back to your seat. Later, you okay? You go and make that auntie's name. I want every one of us to kindly rise up as we we pray. Everybody, rise up, please. Let's just begin to say thank you to God for tonight, for what He had done, and for the souls. You don't understand. Can we clap to Jesus even first? Let's clap to the Lord. Nobody can save a nant. <laughs> it's only Jesus that can save. Let's clap to God. Let's appreciate God for the souls he has saved into his kingdom. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. 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 In Jesus' mighty name, we are worshipped. Father, we have made you happy tonight. <laughs> Your children have come back to you. And we, all of us, we have praised you. Father, we say thank you, Lord, in Jesus' name. Every blessings, the double portion of blessings that was upon David, that God said, I found a man after my heart. Let that double portion of the, of the blessings of David rest upon us in Jesus' name. We will never go back to the world in the name of Jesus. Above all, Lord, on the last day, none of us will miss heaven in Jesus' name. Thank you, everlasting Father. Blessed be the name of the Lord. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Hallelujah. Let's put our hands together for Jesus. Louder, 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 louder. Amen. How many of us have been blessed this night? Amen. Wow. Such an awesome time in God's presence. Amen. We are done now. We are wrapping up. Thank you so much, everyone that stayed up till now. So finally, we are just going to call on our pastor, Pastor Ayopule Martins for the closing prayer. Thank you. Let's put our hands together, please. Praise the Lord. Praise the living Jesus. We really want to appreciate God for Ignite 2.0. And I can assure you by God, 3.0 will be minimum five times what you have seen today. Amen. That means all of you will be returning with a testimony of divine enlargement. Amen. You will be returning with a testimony of divine decoration. And that by the time I see you next year, many of you will have twins and triplets. Many singles will be married. In fact, many of you will be so loaded. So shall it be in the name of Jesus. I know that anytime we praise God, apart from the fact that blessings come down, God himself comes down. And when God comes down, there is no one that can limit or hinder what he will do in your life. And beginning from now, you begin to see that in the name of Jesus. I want to appreciate every one of us, particularly all our church leaders that have been here, that have gone, all our sisters, all our brothers, Reverend Brian, Pastor Apia, Daddy Beckley, uh, Mommy Adesoya, a lot of us. I want to appreciate every one of us here tonight. Uh, to the people that have mentioned and people that have not mentioned, you are all special. And I pray that the grace and the power of God will rest upon you all in the name of Jesus. When you call one, a thousand will answer in the name of Jesus. And I know that God, that you have come to honor, will honor you all the days of your life. You will never be alone. Amen? You will never lack crowd in your life. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. And so, without for that, we also want to thank mommy and daddy all the way from Nigeria uh, Minister Bekis we want to really appreciate God for their lives very humble, very powerful we are so blessed and I know that like I said next year will be powerful I can assure you don't be afraid <laughs> next year will be what? will be powerful, amen so God will keep every one of us beyond that time when it shall be Ignite 3.0. And you know, 3 is the number of Trinity. That means it shall be triple, triple portion for every one of us. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. So let's be on our feet. 
Let's share the grace in fellowship. Let's thank the Lord for all that he has done for us. One, two, go. In the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit, rest and abide with us now and forevermore. Amen. Surely, God's goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our lives, and we shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Peace. Give it to your neighbor. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow you all the days of your life. And you will dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. Amen. Peace of the Lord upon you. Amen. Hallelujah.